Friends, on the 7th of September, 100 years ago this year, a young Frank Duff in Dublin, Ireland, gathered with 14 other friends for the first meeting of what we now know as the Legion of Mary. Young people in faith and hope and love gathering to live out their baptismal calling to be a presence of the Spirit of God in our world. That first meeting in Dublin has now grown such that the Legion of Mary is present in 170 countries throughout the world and in nearly 2,000 dioceses, including our own here in Melbourne. And so on this uh, centenary of the first meeting of the Legion of Mary, I invite everyone to join with me in giving thanks and praise to the God who has given us the grace that we might be uh, his witnesses in the world. All who are members of the Legion of Mary or have been and are now currently members, uh, to all of you, I offer my prayer of blessing. And even during this particular lockdown period, I know that pr the Presidium in Epping Parish of the Legion of Mary has been doing wonderful work as an example of um, offering the uh, rosary online throughout this time. Um, there is a gift of prayer that has been uh, present for us uh, through this pandemic. So to the Legion of Mary throughout the world, but especially here for the, for the members of the Legion of Mary here in the Archdiocese of Melbourne, may the Lord fill you with his blessing on this uh, centenary of the founding of the Legion of Mary by a young friend, Frank Duff, and that, uh, that witness of him who is a servant of God might be something that is a witness for us today. And may Almighty God bless the Legion of Mary, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.